Reliefs could soon be coming to parts of West Ashley that often flood. Charleston City Council discussed this week prioritizing one area that was part of the Church Creek Basin drainage study. News 2's Levine has more on how that project would get started. There's a whole list of areas that are involved in the Church Creek Basin drainage project, but one area where council believes they can begin is here at Hickory Farms. And floods the streets in this neighborhood before making Charleston's out director of public service showed me the plan on her map. Road. Under this proposed plan, we'd actually intercept the water here in the right of way and take it down below the majority of the neighborhood into this existing channel. And that area city councilman, Harry Griffin, is excited to get started. There's a lot of neighborhoods that are affected, and that's why this is so important. Flooding over the past three years here in the area known as the Church Creek Basin sparked the need for an in-depth study of how to fix the issues. The researchers drafted a list of projects, which includes Hickory Farms. The project isn't a total go yet, but this week, City Council decided the Hickory Farms project would be the easiest and the cheapest. Which puts it at still a, a pretty good priority in terms of helping a lot of people in the basin with flooding. The next step is for council to vote on an amended contract that would get the ball rolling on this project that could come at the next city council meeting. In West Ashley, Libba Holling, 